Well, let's just talk about the fight itself. I mean, this was, uh, uh, this was a lot of back and forth, a lot of excitement. How did, how did it play out for you? I'm actually upset with myself, man. I could have done that without taking any of the damage I did. So, you know, I'm not happy. Were you not, uh, was it the, your technique, your approach, or what was it? It was like my timing. I couldn't just, I couldn't get it. Like, I was there. I had my movement. I had all that, I felt. But right when I got in there, I just, I couldn't catch his because he's, He's a very awkward fighter, you know, he, he bounces like three steps before he takes a step in and I was just like, like, okay, when the fuck is he going to, oh, pardon me, when's he going to actually come in, you know, I was like, and then I just, I started getting cautious, sitting back and I waited trying to counter strike and I didn't even pursue my game plans, which was hit the angles, kick to the body, come back with hands, I was throwing one strikes at a time, I'm like, I don't even want to go through what I should have done, I should have knocked him out in the first round without taking these. Well, I don't even think of it like that, you know. I try to finish. I don't care about rounds, you know. I'm going in there. I'm going to try to finish. I'm putting everything on the line every time, you know. Yeah, I heard my corner saying, I got to win this round at the end of the fight. And then I clipped him with something. And then right when he came to the side, I just threw that uppercut. And that's what knocked him out, not the one after. The one after, I didn't even fucking pardon, I didn't even hit him. I missed his head. <laughs> but... I don't know, man. I'm not happy tonight. I know but, you were excited to get back in here and fight again so quickly. I mean, did that have any factor into why maybe you, you know, that you did? Get I don't in? think so. You know, I, it's just I can't explain it. You know, I can't. Sometimes I get stuck in brawl mode and I just get hit, get hit, get hit. Forget my whole game plan. I want to hit you back, and it goes against everything my coaches go against, go with. You know, the whole thing is to go in there is look the same when I come out. And as you can see, I don't look the same. <laughs> yeah, I look like a squirrel holding nuts in my cheek right now. <laughs> so it's as simple as that. You know, I just, I'm not happy with my performance, but I'm happy that I won. You know, at least I got the W and the KO, but not the way I wanted to. You had a fairly uh, quick turnaround. Do you feel like that's something that you want to do again? Like, do you want to get right I'll do it again right now just to prove that I can, I can knock people out without getting hit. You know, and now I want to do it even more. And uh, I don't care. I'll fight anybody anytime. I don't care. It doesn't matter what weight class you want. <laughs> that last flurry, did you know there were only 10 seconds or no, sec no time left? I mean, or were you I heard ready? 30 seconds, and then he started falling back against the cage because he must have been trying to conserve some energy because I did notice he was getting tired. He started <laughs> breathing deeply and stuff, and I hit him with a jab and made him, like, do that, and I split his lip open. And, uh, no, I really... I just heard 30 seconds, and I was like, oh, I'm going to put a little pressure on him. And then, bop, got him with the right hand. But totally not the way I wanted to, man. I'm really upset with myself. I'm probably just going to go home tonight. I'm not even going to celebrate. <laughs> so. Do you feel like that performance is bonus-worthy? I think any knockout should be bonus-worthy, you know. But, but that's up to Dana. I mean, I got skipped out on the last one. I thought I had a pretty good performance for my UFC debut, submitting someone in the first round. And I called out for the bonus, but never got it. So hopefully this time they saw it. And that's two fights in the UFC with two finishes. So come on, guys. You know, what else are you looking for? What else can I do? You know, I'm finishing people, and I'm making it exciting. As you can see, I can get dropped and still finish you. I don't care. You better hit like a freight train or something to take me out. I don't care. Where do you want to go next? Do you, want, do you, want, do you want to talk to one name? You know, hey. I don't care. Just give me somebody. I'll punch anyone in the head. It doesn't matter. Thank you guys. <laughs>